Hello, welcome to the channel. Today I'm in Suffolk, back in beautiful Suffolk, and I'm in Felixstowe, right next to sea. We're going to take a bit of a route around, and we're going to take a ride on, if you can see it. The view, the big wheel, which has just reopened again for another season. I think it's going to be a permanent fixture here in Felixstowe, so let's have a bit of a look around and take a ride on that. So I'm starting the video outside of Manning's Amusements, which was the original 1933 site for Billy Butlin's, or one of Billy Butlin's first resorts. So this is what it looks like today, and this is what it looked like in 1933. As you can see, there's a big old wooden roller coaster at the side there, but sadly, that is no more. I'm going to take you a look around and see what's there today. So we've got the amusement arcade, which is full of retro games and stuff. I think we're going to have a bit of a moot stay in a minute. Rock Sharp, of course. And we're just heading into Beach Street, which is a load of uh, containers turned into shops and restaurants. Very cool little place to hang out. We've got some shots to the side, vintage shop. Waffle Shack. Cool vintage clothing shop there. So I'm guessing this is pretty much where the roller coaster used to be. This is pretty cool. All shapes. An art gallery and a double decker bus. Wow, really cool. And here we have a relic from the Butlins days. This can be seen on some of the old photographs. I'll try and find one now so you can have a look. So yeah, it's changed a little bit since then, but at least the building still remains. Should do something with this for sure. So that's looking back into Beach Street and the back of the arcade. So we're just inside Manning's Amusements now, as you can see, lots of cool old games. Cute little carousel there. Really nice. Okay, let's head out back into the beach street. Nice fountain there, it's looking really cool. And just across the way there, they've put up the big wheel again. I don't think it's open just yet. I saw them doing a bit of work on there earlier, so that should be up and running soon. And I'll go on a bit of a ride. So here we are outside of the view. As you can see, it's open. It's only six quid to go on. So let's do it. See you on there. So this is ours, number 15. Let's do it. So we're on board. Let's check it out. Nice little cabins for you to sit in. I reckon it seats about six, but it's just me on my own. Yay! I'll flip it round so you can see the view. Let's go. So we're getting to the top. I've just remembered I'm terrified of heights. Forgot about that. <laughs> I remember now. <laughs> so if the camera's a bit shaky, you know why. <laughs> you can see right down the seafront, there's the pier in the distance there. I think we're literally right at the top. The bowling green there. And you can see the docks at the back. Woo so there's Manning's where we've just been earlier. Down there. So the roller coaster we we're talking about was just right down the side of Manning's. It's going quite slow at the moment, but I think that's because they're filling up, so. If it stays at this speed, it'll be all right, I think. <laughs> nice view over the sea there. Starting to tip, pick up a little bit of speed now. And it's starting to rain. Thankfully, I've got a roof. So we're just down at the bottom again. We're letting more people on, I think. So just to the side there, we've got salt water, forum amusement, and Manning's at the back. 
so yeah I definitely still don't like heights but this is pretty cool it's nice and slow you can see the beach at the back there Ooh. it's swaying a bit oh. <laughs> what am I doing at all it's quite high as you can probably see from the side but I'm all right I'm all enclosed hopefully <laughs> I think they're probably letting more people in so whether or not it's going to start spinning round I doubt it but I hope not anyway <laughs> Such a lovely view from up here though There's a lot of container ships out there Oh I can see sea land out the back there A few yachts looking about Yay! I'm trying to smile <laughs> So we're literally right at the top There's no one higher um, maybe they heard me saying I'm scared of heights, I don't know, <laughs> but I was just stuck at the top. <laughs> Please move! <laughs> There's a little view from right at the bottom of the cabin, whatever these things are. And I'll just pan around so you can see a view all the way around. The docks are there, We're still at the top, more people. We've been here quite a while, so yeah, hopefully it's just because they're filling it up. Don't fancy getting stuck up here. Oh my god. I don't think it's been open that long. This year anyway, it was here last year. And I think it's going to be a permanent fixture in Felix though, which is pretty cool. Um, wow, we're really swinging a bit now. Oh, it's moving. Yay! We've got movement. I'll turn the camera around the other way so you can see that side. So looking down the other way. Beautiful sky. And a little panoramic view of the sea. Blime, it's proper windy now. Ooh. It's all right here though, it's quite cosy. Oh, we're not quite at the top now, as you can see. Yay! But yeah, look, we're proper swinging. Ooh! Wee! We're off! Yay! So there's the docks at the back. There's a big old ship in there. See all the containers stacked up? I don't know if you can make that out or not. And another overhead view of Manning's. With the containers there. Fountain. And that's the arcade we just walked through briefly. Now I'd really recommend coming on this if you're in Felix though. Even if you're scared of heights because you're inside the little cabin and it's fine, it's all good. You don't feel like exposed in any way. So that was the view in Felixstowe. I really enjoyed that. Despite my fear of heights, it was really cool. There it is. And as you can see, it's right on the beach, which we are now about to take a walk down. Let's do it. So here we are on the beach. I love that sound, the waves lapping by the pebbles. Really lovely. It's quite a pebbly beach, but there are some sandy areas where you can come and sit. And there's the view again. So yeah, it's really nicely positioned right on the beach there. Lovely. And there's the beautiful blue sky. I feel like a swim. Not got my swimming stuff unfortunately, otherwise I would be in. Give you a little bit of a zoom around there. Such a lovely day. I love Suffolk, it's such a beautiful place. Okay, let's crack on down the seafront and see what else we can find. So I've just left the beachside area briefly, it's only there because at the side of me we have an adventure golf. Let's go and check it out. I saw this from up on the uh, big wheel, so let's go and have a look what it looks like from down here. So here's the adventure golf. Nice water feature in the middle, fountains going on, waterfalls. 
That looks really cool. Adventure golf. Nice thing to do on a sunny day. And it is, as you can see, just across from the beach there. Okay, let's keep on going. So this is quite a new area. We've got a bulls, 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 you know what I mean. The little bowl game thing pitch there. Pitch, ground, whatever it's called. Oh my God, I don't know what I'm on about. Uh, in the middle here, we've got some table tennis tables and a gym over there. There's a lot of people playing on it, so I'm not gonna go on video over there, but there's a climbing wall and some gym equipment. And this is right on the seafront. Oh, there's a chessboard there. Wow, really cool. And next door, we've got a nice postcard souvenir shop and some kids rides and stuff there. Let's go and have a mooch. I know they moved a lot of beach huts off the sea uh, seafront because they got flooded with the sea coming in. So they've come inland a little bit and created this little area. So yep, seashore village. Beach up for sale, beach up for sale. Really cool. So we're just down by the pier now, really still pier. You can't go all the way down to the bottom, but you can go kind of halfway. There's Boardwalk Cafe on there. It's a nice arcade at the front. We've got a fish and chips place, a cafe, ice creams, all the usual stuff. Let's go and have a look. Yeah, we've got ice creams there. This is the entrance to the arcade, just here. A few old rides at the front, which is pretty cool. And a chippy at the end. So tempted, so tempted. I'm trying to be good, but you know, don't have to be that good, do I? So we're just down the side of the pier. I'm going to look over the beach there. There's another little burger place. Some nice flats over there. We've got a Domino's over there. If you want a pizza, some more fish and chips, rock shop. There's a pool there as well. Feel it's still a leisure centre. So we're just taking a walk on the pier. I'll show you how far you can get up. It's not that far. There's a little coffee shop or something there, the deck. And I think that's as far as you can get. Yep, it sure is. I don't know if they're going to do anything with the other bit, but let's have a look. And this is the back entrance to the arcade. You can get into the arcade there. And the Boardwalk Cafe is just down the end there. And you can even sail a pirate ship if you want. View down the side, right up to the big wheel, what we've just been on. Cool, it's a beautiful, relaxing garden just right on the seafront there. I'll spin around so you can see where it is. So, there's the seafront, and there's the pier, what we've just been down. So, yeah, it's a real nice kind of place to come and chill out. Fountain there, and from the top, there are some amazing views. So, let's go up and check them out. There's some toilets there as well, if you need the loo when you come here. <laughs> yep, just head up to the top. I just pan around so you can see it from here. So beautiful. There's lots of places to sit and chill. Lovely. So peaceful up here. And here's the view from the very top. Lovely. So that was my little look around Felixstowe. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please subscribe. Please hit the like button. Click the little bell for notifications. And I will see you all very soon. Bye.